Yo, what's up guys, Frosty10 here, back with another glitch. Today we're showing you guys how to do the RC to Commerce glitch. In this, in this video, you will need a RC Bandido with the mods on. You don't specifically need F1 wheels, you can have Benzo, it doesn't really matter. And you need the car that you will be transferring the mods to, and you need an X80 Proto. If you don't have an X80 Proto, the glitch won't work. Okay, let's get started. So all you want to do is, when you have your X80 Proto in your Arena Workshop, all you need to do is hop into your X80 Proto. And once you hop in, press run the d-pad. Once you press run the d-pad, you automatically load into your arena workshop. And then once you load in, all you need to do is back out and press Y so you can hop out of your XA Proto. Once you exit the vehicle, the door will hop off. All you need to do with the door is move it um, all the way over to your mechanic. And you will need like the Benny's mechanic or something. It doesn't really matter which mechanic you are. So you need to move it all the way over to your mechanic and try and get him underneath. I'll skip the uh, skip it until I get them on it, and then, yeah, I'll show you where you need to put them. Once you get your mechanic on the door, all you need to do is move him over to this exact location, just in front of your door. Once you're just in front of your door, all you need to do is walk up to him and hold, uh, well press Y to see if you t automatically teleport into your vehicle if that doesn't work you just need to try move him a bit move him some more, as you can see he's not it's not allowing me to teleport at this current moment so all I need to do is uh, move him a little bit and then it allowed me to uh, hop into the car I'll be right back into when I show you Once you've moved them into the correct position, all you need to do is hop back into your X80 Proto and return it to storage. As you return it to storage, you should see that the door that you hopped out of is missing. As you can see, it's missing, so I just hopped out. And now you need to just hop into the car that you want the um, mods to come onto. Once you hop into the car, you need to just press around the D-pad to go to the to modify in the workshop. Once you load in, all you need to do is hop out of your vehicle. Again. This time the door won't come off, so once you hop out of the vehicle, all you need to do is delete all your re job requests on your phone, and as you can see, it's doing that glitch where it, it teleports me into the car. If that doesn't happen, all you need to do is just restart the video and restart the glitch, so you can hit it. So all you need to do is contact Simeon now. Once you contact the Simeon, request a job. Once you request a job, walk over to your RC Bandito. Press around the D-pad, go to lids or livery, and just scroll up for about three seconds. And once you, when that, when that's done, exit. So this is the hard part. So all you need to do now, I'll slow it down for you guys. All you need to do now is press forward on your joystick to press and press Y. Then you need to pull up your phone, do the hold pause trick on the job. And once you hit the beep, hold pause menu and hold left on the D-pad. And once that's done, it should automatically put you in a job and it will give you a little glimpse of the car. This is me not competing it properly because I messed up one part. So that's what the glitch will look like so far and I'll skip it to the cliff where I actually hit the glitch in a second. But when once you load out, before you carry on with the glitch again and try it again, all you need to do is um, go to your RC Bandito and do the livery or lids thing again because if you don't do that, the glitch won't work. And I'll skip it to the clip now. Okay, this is the clip of me hitting it. I will slow it down for you guys, just in case. Just a second. Once again, the process is pr look forward on your joystick, press Y, and then pull up your phone, go to the mission, do the hold pause trick. Once you go into the pause trick, press pause, and then hold left on the joystick, and then once that's done, escape pause, and it should automatically transfer you into this, that screen where you see the mods transferred over, and it should automatically load you up into the job. If you've if you done it correctly, it would look like that. I actually hit this on my sixth try, so I didn't. It wasn't like straight after each other. And then once you load it out of the job, you can just press B onto the job, and as you can see, the mods has transferred over to the car. And once the mods transfer over to the car, to save it, all you need to do is hop back into the vehicle. Once you hop back into the vehicle, press around the D-pad to go to the workshop. And all you need to do is change one thing, so like change the number plate or the horn, and that's it. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you liked it. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed. See you next time.